Look, team loaded just like Lux LaBuddy, you gon' get this work. Wow. Yeah, I need me a straight jacket, cause you know I'm going zerk. Hit stick crazy, now watch me put them in the dirt. Ooh. Test my user, you gon' feel it's getting lurk. Yeah. Hey, first quarter, put up 30 on that boy. 30. Add him to the highlight tape, I'm getting dirty on that boy. Ooh. Stick work up on the catch, I'm getting swervy on that boy. Don't heat me up to play no games, no. don't disturb me with that noise, cause you capping. Cow. You beating me like a unicorn, it won't happen. Ah. Poetry in motion on that field, I get to snapping. I make it look easy, cause I do this on the norm. norm. When you hear that alarm, get out the way, cause there go. Eh. Well, I had an doggy bone, man. Uh, make sure y'all smash, uh, hit the smash, uh, smash the like button, man. What am I talking about? Uh, let me know if I should go get that right tackle, because I'm gonna keep it a buck. Uh, just a quick squad update for y'all. We went and got Joe Thomas and Will Shields. We still get shedded. You know what I'm saying? So if you think of having these uh, dudes with 40,000 abilities is going to change something, it, it it didn't change much. I might still get dog at right tackle, though, because I'm a sick individual like that. So I got the Will Shields, the Joe Thomas. Then I had to revamp the offense uh, because of the man meta. So I'm running CD Lamb for the dude blade me. I got do blame me on Plexico and then Herman Moore for the max security. All those guys do a great job of breaking press. I might go get uh Ingram, but Wilder be cooking for me, dog. And I and I just like his card. So where I put him at, he usually fries and I keep him in unbumpables. So yeah, got those guys on offense. This is what the offense looking like. Of course, Corduroy's Patterson always for me. You know what I'm saying? It's just like having another wide receiver. I could go get Ingram, put him in this Latham spot, but I be needing Latham for when I want to block Dollar. But yeah, or put him at fullback and then sub him in and just run Ingram on the outside. I might do that, get real glitchy. But yeah, on defense, we did pick up Yak Tatum. You know what I'm saying? He he been cool. The nigga real little though, man. He been cool. Ryan Clark is my other other uh uh sub safety who I well he's not a safe sub safety, but safety that I run in the box. Nigga really little too. So sometimes I got extra AP, so I just sub in uh the wide receiver the old nigga played for the Eagles, but they they got him as a safety. What's his name? Harold Carmichael. I sub him in. And then we picked up you won't see him in this game play, but we picked up Gronk. We had a free golden ticket, got, got Gronkowski. And those are the pickups for the squadron of Negroes, man. So, yeah, enjoy this video about college football, man. Like, comment down below, man. And as always, boy, I love y'all. We finna go zerk, zerk on this college fusé ball, man. Well, I had that nuggy bone, man. We back on them, my dizzy. Oh, I got another banger, but we also finna talk about some things, boy. So, uh, smash that like button, man, please. Subscribe if you're brand new, man, and let's, let's, let's see. Let's get into a banger. He got, is it, what? This somebody? So, collage football is less than a month away. It is three weeks away, G. And y'all already know we going all in. Oh, it's going to be on the main page. Well, this page, um, I'm still keeping my podcast channel. Then I'm going, once Madden 25 drops, I'm going to create a second page. And then post Madden on the main page. College football on the second page. Going to be daily uploads because I just feel like I'm really going to enjoy college football and all the different things that that game brings. But what college football did release was the top 25 toughest places to play. And uh, y'all put me on game, you know what I'm saying? Let Unk, let, let, let Unk know that that's a touchdown on the nigga Scale BD. And if I win this, I'm going to the Super Bowl. I need packs. I'm down to my last six million coins. But yeah, let me know where y'all are from. And if 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 your place made the list, put it down. If it didn't, you nigga, your your place weak, boy. Y'all weak. But yeah, here's the list right here. And uh, Texas a and I think, ain't that where uh, Jonathan Manziel last played at, boy? And that's numero uno. I didn't even know them niggas was like that with the uh, college foosie ball. So put me hip on game. 
The only reason I really care, hold on, we're going to play for the uh, double post. Only reason I really care about this list, honestly, is because this list does set a meta for college football. Let me cook. Right? So you got teams like Alabama, number two. Ohio State is like uh, number four. Knock that out. Let's get it. Uh, Georgia, five. Oh, like you got a lot of like, of course, you got the best teams in the game all through this top 20 fizzy, right? So we're not going to be ignorant and just act like highly good quick hike. Warren Sapp, you know, I should put I should put lurk artists on him for those times I do get quick hike. But um, yeah, we're not going to act like those teams that are going to be high overall because we play in the college foosie ball. So. The, the stadium noise and things of that nature are going to play a large fact in the game, and it should. Knock that out. Okay, or or, 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 just, or just miss it completely, Wooly. I don't even want the football. I don't want nothing, man. I'm finna take a nap because that's what you just did. But, yeah, uh, just in my opinion, it'll say it because if I'm just playing the game and I want to win games, if I can go get one of the better teams in the game in Alabama, and knowing they have one of the hardest stadiums to play in, so I'm pretty sure that that'll translate in the college foosie ball, of course I'm going to do that. Why wouldn't I go grab the best team with one of the hardest stadiums? So what does that mean? The people who grab those Alabamas and Ohio States, I think even Michigan is in like the top 20. But those teams, and then... The people to counter that, what are you going to do? You're going to go get, I think it was the Clemson QB they showed and other players who are immune to that. So they don't get shook it up. They don't, they, they don't get, that's a Harlem shake, my bad. They don't get shook up when you uh, play into these uh, really tough stadiums. So now you've already created a dynamic for meta teams. You know what I'm saying? So you, it, it, it could be a small chance, and I'm hoping it don't happen. But yeah, there there is a chance where you're gonna find out that folks is finna just grab these great teams with this great home field advantage and they finna get the whooping ass and cooking up. You know what I'm saying? Which I can't really like I actually wanted college football for the home team and the home stadium and things of that nature to have a grand old effect on the game. That is a beautiful free form. But I, I, I but what I don't want is for it to be Actually, you kind of do. You want it to be OP. Unless unless I get ball first, I come down, punch buddy ass in the mouth with a quick touchdown first drive, silence everybody. You know what I'm saying? I feel like those type of things in the game. Please flick this up. This nigga went to 3-4. Nope. Nope. I had a touchdown, but 68. Who was that? Will Shields. <laughs> the nigga with 47 abilities on him. But, yeah, um, if I come down, punch uh, Alabama right in the mouth, first drive, Jackson State on the move. We we, we knock down Selma quick. Dog, nigga, do you see what's... <sighs> Woosai, Woosai. But, yeah, and then I feel like that whole, that advantage should kind of dissipate. You know what I'm saying? Shouldn't be as big. Now, if you, if I if I if I'm playing in Alabama and I come down and 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 you stop me first drive, oh, they should be rocking in that boy. You know what I'm saying? I I want to feel it like I want to be at the crib, nervous because I got stopped my first drive. Now Alabama is driving down and and and, and, I, and I'm shitting bricks. Like I can't I can't my my audibles ain't really clicking on all cylinders. I can't see my player. Is he in a purple? No, that's a gray. Oh, Jesus. You know what I'm saying? I, I want it to be that. I want the game to function like that, man. So I, that, that's, that's going to be dope they put that up in there uh, like I'm thinking it is. Why didn't I freeform that? <sighs> Just make the tackle, man. Make the tackle. Okay, somebody do something. That was my fault. But I'm going to read, I'm going to run the list down to y'all. Y'all let me know. Uh, one, Texas A&M already said that. Two, Alabama easy. 
uh, De Numero 2, which is, you know what I'm saying, them niggas got greatness written all over them, I guess. Three, LSU. Four, Ohio State. Five, Georgia. Eight, uh, Penn State. My father, uh, he, 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 was, he was at uh, State Penn a lot. So, you know what I'm saying? R.I.P. Pops. He was a huge, huge state pen guy. So, yeah. They, they, and there was definitely a lot of ruckus in state pen when he was there. You know what I'm saying? I, I feel like state pen is on top of the list, for real. It was a lot of, it was real rough there at state pen. So, you know what I'm saying? You got you got to be a bit of a thugger trying to survive. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they should be new metal. Mm. But yeah, seven Wisconsin, eight Ohio, I mean Oklahoma State, nine Florida State, ten Florida, oh, 11, Oregon, man, Oregon. That's short for origami. G. A lot of y'all didn't really know that about you know what I'm saying, which is why I was I'm just helpful to be able to put y'all on. Uh, twelve Clemson, thirteen Tennessee, fourteen Auburn, uh. We on 15. Let me make these adjusties real quick. And boom. Okay. All right. All right. All right. 15. South Carolina. 16. Michigan. The boy. Boy. Are you? I'm going to keep it a buck maybe. As, as y'all know that my daughter was born in Ann Arbor. Uh, my daughter's mama is a graduate from U of M. And, um. I guess it'd be rocking shit. I don't know. Game day, you could be, if you was in Arbor during game day, it, traffic was traffic was flooded. So, so look, sixteen. I mean, seventeen. Virginia Tech, eighteen. Just say U U. Is that Utah University? Like, what? Is, what like, what is U U? Yeah, man, I go to U U. Big U U, not the little one though. That's cr like you. You is insane, man. And I gave that up, man. Nineteen Texas, twenty Iowa, twenty one Notre Dame, twenty two Michigan Stizzy. That's what all the frizzies was at. U of M had some frizzies too. Um, for y'all who don't know, that's how I ended up. My daughter was a cheat baby. Uh, y'all y'all heard that story, so we not even gonna get into that. You know what I'm saying? And then we got a uh, 24 is, no, 23, Arkansas, 24, Boise State. They just got, like, I, I had to write a lot of this down, G, because they just showed the team emblem and then just thought, yeah, y'all got it now. You know what I'm saying? But now I'm finna bomb two more, uh, with two more, I'm finna bomb more than two niggas that bomb now because I got pure anger in my heart. And 25 is... Mississippi State, I think. Yeah, man, I don't care about none of this. For real. I'm running with uh Jackson State. Go. African American. I don't really know what their team name is. It gotta be the African Americans, man. It's a HBCU. So I'm running with the Jackson State African Americans. Did y'all know it's a HBCU that's majority white? I'ma run with them. That's that's gonna be my that's that's gonna be the squad that I run with, man. And I'm getting dubs. So yeah, when they dropped that list, I was like, ooh, that is a very interesting talking point. When you talk about like college football and you start th thinking about the small details inside of that game that's gonna make it what it's supposed to be. Okay, all right, I need to get over there. Uh, me being able to get in that scene is probably going to end up either winning or losing me this game. Because that, it, 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 I, I think he throws that based off my user, too. Like, if he don't see me in the right spot, user-wise, good knockout. Uh, that's a quick throw because I am in a cover uh, three shell. <clears throat> but, yeah, bro, it's, it's just an interesting talking point to see. You know what I'm saying? How much those will affect the teams and the game in general. Just, just, mother just coming out, punching you in the mouth in these big stadiums. And because this is the thing that's going to make home feel so crazy is if 
you go play, say if a dude is running Texas A&M, you head up to Texas, well, down to Texas to play them boys. They get ball first. Because, you know, the stadium going to be rocking off the rip. I need a better uh, animation than that. Stadium going to be rocking off the rip. You go, they, they get the ball first. They go score. And then it's on you to try to get us, like, try to get your offense moving. After that, that's my fault. That is my fault. If I three wreck, I do not need to drop bait. I need to run with the crosser. Like, that's that's, that's going to be crazy. And I think I, this is why I need to get my adjustments out because. Uh, good stuff. Fumble, fumble, fumble. No. But I do feel like that's the part that's going to make college football super great. It's those small details. And now, thank you, thank you, thank you. And now you got to run up. I think he blocked his running back. And you got to run up against that, bro. Try to navigate, get a touchdown, man, against a raucous house. So I think meta teams, um, Auburn, um, LSU, Clemson, because I think they quarterback. I should have left him. If I leave him in a flat zone, I get a flat zone KO right there. I shouldn't have blitzed my user. But, yeah, you uh, rock out with the teams that's immune. So, a Clemson, anybody with those great quarterbacks. And then uh, Michigan, because they O-line run game, probably going to be elite. Alabama, of course. Um, Low-key, I, I wonder where, where Colorado is going to go in that. Because they they like they going to have Shador, who's going to be a superstar. Then they got, uh, I don't know if the brother still play. I think he does. Yeah, he does. At safety. Travis Hunter at corner. And so they going to have pieces of their own that's just going to make them one of the teams people just enjoy playing with. So I'm, 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 I'm they're like, just, just them dropping that list. And then my imagination running wild. Big Hulk Hogan. No, I ain't no Big Hulk Hogan, G. Man, I'm so upset about the Hulk Hogan thing. Just so y'all know, I just found out recently. But, yeah, that, that, that got me super excited for the game. And just, just to get something different, a different feel of the Le Fousset Bowl. Let me get that. Let me get that. I remember that play. I remember that play. I remember. I remember you ran in when you scored your, oh, uh, no. Was it your last touchdown? Yeah. I remember it, G. So, yeah, man. I don't, I don't know, G. Y'all might not be as excited as I am. This gonna be the like just as a content creator being able to get my hands on this new college football and as entertaining and just and just like sexy as I am, I'm entertaining, I'm wild sexy, um, I'm creative. I get to do more in this college football. Like it won't be just about uh, mutt cards and grinding the college football leaderboards. It's CFM type joints and. Um, hold on, hold on, nigga, hold on, hold on, hey, hey, I see the gap, Thomas Henry, uh, Archibald Brady, baby, to the crazy, to the crazy, big Tommy Brady, big Tommy Brady, let get it, but yeah, bro, I'm, uh, I'm wild excited, man, for this, hopefully, you know what I'm saying, it does extremely well, and maybe I make college football my main and move Madden to this second channel I'm about to create. I already got a second channel, but it's a more of a podcast channel that I have not been utilizing. Even though I talk, we we do. I'm 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 moving all podcast talk to my podcast channel because we do a podcast talk on Sundays. Another opportunity for me and Siri. Uh, see what I'm saying? I got the knockout, but I wasn't there in time. All of the sun in my vision became so clear. Another thing, uh, and this is something that we have not gotten any clarity on. College football, primarily, you know what I'm saying? The players, is it's not like, it's not like Madon where you can sub, in, like where you would want to do the sub linebacker thing. I think with the college football, you definitely want your backers on the field. So with wanting your backers on the field, our backers going to do a better job of animating in this one? 
You know what I'm saying? So we don't have to do the sub linebacker. Because if we get if, if linebackers they actually jump in college football, it's gonna make the game so much better. Cause now we can deep dive into different defenses and we can test different things out. It doesn't have to be so repetitive as Madden is. Uh as far as the meta go. Like like it won't be no excuse. Like everybody can good pass, good, good free form. In that situation, I got a vert hook right there. I got a vert hook to take that away. And he just earned three. Good stuff. But that's something that they haven't addressed, which I'm looking forward to. It's just finding out whether or not linebackers will be usable or if we're going to use them the same way in 25 and either put them on the D-line or sub them out the game. That's going to be the tough part, bro. So hopefully they get that. Ah, my finger, man. Why the hell I just smashed my finger like an idiot? Oh, man. I think it gets Buddy. I still need to start util uh, utilizing more vertical hooks against him. I think I think that's the move. I'm at, I'm not mad at that, Mylotta. I'm not mad at that. But I'm about to get that. I'm about to do I got everything for my free golden ticket. What I'm hoping is that they give me... I'm going to Gronk because I want to get rid of Mylotta. See... Just because he's not as reactive as I want. So I want to go Gronk. Or I do QB. Hopefully they throw a QB bow or something in there. But yeah, against this guy, I, I kind of have to go three Rex because he loves those delays. Um, not delays, but those uh, backside ends that come across the middle because I'm getting pulled by his crossers. And then right here, hold on. I think this is the play where I need the three wrecks. This is where I need the three wrecks. Okay. When he goes, to, especially to the bunch of uh, X nasty, hoping none of this is in the Madonna. And then a regular bunch offset is where he likes to throw in the seams. So that's where I would want the vert hooks. He, he, knock that out, please. Because he, he's doing a really good job of quick hiking me too. Like right, Just to keep it a buck, he, he keeping a nigga off, off guard completely. So if I can get over here and check, I can keep this three wreck on for that play. <sighs> Stupid. I literally said earlier, if I three wreck it, I don't need to bait it. I can stay with the crosser, man. Uh, kind of. I'm just expecting. Oh, oh God. Okay, right. This RP. This uh RPO round for show. So I'm gonna shoot this gap to try to blow it up. Oh, okay, we good. We good. We good. Oh, so he and nigga that went to DB fire. I'm going to just go. I'm going to cook with the QB draw. I'm going to cook with the QB draw until he decides to pinch that line. Yeah, same, same tactic from last year. Have him pinch that line. Then we uh, DB fire no longer becomes an option. So he can either go to the free safety blitz, uh, the three or the five man loop. I don't know what he just did right there because he probably would have got a knockout. Or he can just rush three and do adjustments, but then I'm going to pick that dollar apart if he does do that. So, or I could do what I'm doing right here and just run the ball at this look out of bunch. You know what I'm saying? Especially that bunch flex inside zone. Does really well against the DB fire look. Now, all this knowledge that I do have about Madden, my hope is that when college football drops, none of it matters. Because, and y'all know, if any of y'all play anything, any other Madden, like if you know how to play Madden, you know what's going to work, what's not going to work, etc. So you already come in with a little advantage over your opponents because you can hit the ground running. You know what formations you need to go to and try out first. You know what's the what the best route combos in the game hit on. So you finna head over there and get to cooking off those and things of that nature. Like you know what's what in Mad. So I'm hoping in this college that is not the case. I don't know what's what. I'm basically a rookie little bum. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of y'all be on this game. I'm a rookie, musty little bum. I don't know Nathaniel about the Madonna. And then when I hop on this game, I'm really, really, really 
just starting all over for real. But that's probably not the case, man, because it's a video game. And uh, there's just certain rock combos that will always win in this video game. And, that, and like, they don't even have to be your typical stuff that you're used to seeing. Like, just like just this Z corner combo. You know what I'm saying? That will always cook in this game against a cover two shell. He was manned up, but the Zig showed me he was manned up, so I was able to uh, attack that corner route. And I free-formed it, which I didn't when I threw that pick. But it's just certain things, like like just in, in this game and how it's cold, as you know, on that side, it looks like he might be sitting in a little pressure. So he's either going to be uh, flat or cloud flat with the uh with the half over top or or third if you in dollar. So you know it's certain combos you can go to that'll show you and you'll have a good option out of each. Whether it is a uh, cover two, whether he is a uh, baseline man or, and whatnot, you'll know like yo, it's always something that I can go to and cook up in that situation that'll help me out greatly. And that's just going to translate over to um College football, I'm sure. I don't know why I'm singing day 26, G. I'm a rhythmic individual, G. Like right here, I'm looking. I want to see if he mans his up. It's not because he's a... Uh, I want a high ball list to RB. But I might have this corner route, and I do. And But the pressure got there. I had the corner route because I was going to free form it toward the back pylon. High ball, of course. And if I would have picked up the blitz and just left a little one-two there, I probably could have checked down to that zig juke move miss. But don't matter. If an if was a fifth, we'd all be drunk. I don't think he can clock me from from where he is, especially passing the ball. So, so uh, if I I feel like if he does try to clock me, that'll be that'll end up losing him the game. To be honest. Because he, I don't know if he is a great runner of the football. But I got pretty decent uh, run D out of bunch. So unless he going to go in the center. All right, so he is clocking. He is clocking. Which I'm not tripping because I, I feel like I can get a stop. I've gotten two already, I think. But just that, like running two, three yards. I feel like it's going to put him in a position where, he, like, you don't want to run. But you've already been killing clock. Now you're in a position where you got to cook up a dot. And I know you have to cook up a dot. So I'm not even, you know what I'm saying? I'm not even falling for none of the BS, G. For, for like, up to this point, he's been keeping me off balance with his pass game. Pa uh, different formations, different route combo. I got a decent idea of what he likes to do and out of which formation. But this running here, this here, I don't feel like that's it. Because you're not, you're not getting, if you're not breaking good yards... You might put that pressure on yourself, like, all right, let's just get, let's just dot, let's just get back to dotting, and then you're gonna try to cook up one of your uh little seam strip. Okay. Stupid yep. little dummy. Yep, I knew it would come, and he's gone, and I'm gone too. G, smash the like button.